the easiest solar powered ice maker. I'll show you guys how this all works in a second. All this ice is made with 100% solar powered. Nice cold ice water. This refrigerator actually has two solar powered ice makers. It's got one on the bottom freezer and it's got one on the upper part of the um, refrigerator here, right there. Okay, and this refrigerator is 100% solar powered. It is being powered by those solar panels on the ground. I am 100% off grid. That means there is no electrical power coming into this house at all. There is no power lines coming in. So all the power that runs this house, that powers that refrigerator, that creates all that free um, ice is from these solar panels sitting on the ground. These solar panels go through a control system, my power shed, that make everything happen. So this is what's creating all that free ice. These panels just sitting on the ground. Solar panels come in. This is all off grid. This is what powers my home. Uh, solar power comes in through the charge controllers over here on the right. So one, two, and three. Two of them are solar charge controllers. The one on the end is a wind turbine charge controller. So we also have um, wind, uh, wind power that also produces power for the system. Um, that also produces free ice off grid. Uh, and then from there, here's our Tesla batteries right here. These Tesla batteries basically store and hold all the power whenever I need it. I can get it on demand. Um, goes back up through DC breakers. Goes through two outback inverters here. I, and then on this side we have 240 volt um, AC coming out. Then it gets broken up as far as um, through the panels at my home. It goes down this pipe. Goes under the ground. Goes to the house. So the refrigerator is 115 volt or 120 volt really. Uh, and that's what's producing the free ice. So these solar panels is where all the power comes from originally. I mean, well, the sun, of course, right? But um, this is what's collecting and absorbing all this power and then pushing it into the batteries and then back into the whole system and through the house. So it's very easy. Can you get ice off grid on solar power? Absolutely. I'm doing it every day. And it's really nice to have that, that ice whenever you need it, you know? So, is it possible? Absolutely. Anyway, thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys on the next one.